Hey guys, my name is Bindu Madhav Joshi, or in short, Josh Joshi. Today I am going to present you that Ramanujam's theorem, 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 1 by 12, produces discrepancies. Here is a quick snapshot of Ramanujan's theorem uh, given from his notebooks. And the theorem is highlighted in yellow. 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 is equal to minus 1 by 12. The proof of Ramanujan's theorem can be found on a number of internet sites as given below. But today we are going to see that above result gives rise to a number of mathematical discrepancies if it is assumed to be correct. Before proceeding to the discrepancies occurring because of Ramanujan's theorem, let's do some pre-preparation. Let Si, the sum of all integers, represent the Ramanujan sum of the series. So Si is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 12. This is Ramanujan's theorem. Now let's split the above sum Si into two sums. The sum of all odd integers, let's call it SO, and sum of all even integers, let's call it SE. So Si is equal to SO plus SE, which is equal to 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus etc. up to infinity, which is SO, plus 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus etc. up to infinity, which is SE, which is equal to 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus etc. up to infinity, plus 2 into bracket. 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus etc. up to infinity. I have just taken out the common factor 2 in the second series. And now what remains inside the bracket, 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus etc. up to infinity, is also the Ramanujan series. Therefore, Si is equal to SO plus twice Si. In the previous slide, we saw Si, the sum of all integers, is equal to SO, the sum of all integers, plus twice the sum of all integers. So, rearranging the above equation, we get SO is equal to minus SI. And replacing SI by minus 1 by 12, the Ramanujan's theorem, we get SO is equal to minus of minus 1 by 12. So, in inference, SO, the sum of all odd integers, is equal to 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus etc. up to infinity, is equal to 1 by 12. This is result A. Now, let's find the sum of all even integers. On the previous slide, we saw SI sum of all integers is equal to SO sum of all odd integers plus SE sum of all even integers. The value of SI Ramanujan series is minus 1 by 12 is equal to SO, the value of sum of all odd integers is 1 by 12 as seen on the previous slide plus SE. So SE is equal to minus one minus two by twelve. So SE sum of all even integers is equal to two plus four plus six plus eight plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus two by twelve. Let's call it result B. Now we will derive a new sum of one plus one plus one plus one plus etc. up to infinity. We have seen the sum of all odd integers, 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to 1 by 12. And the sum of even integers, which is 2 
2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 1 by 12. So subtracting the result A above from result B, we get 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 2 by 12 minus 1 by 12. Or in other words, 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 3 by 12. So the final result we get 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 3 by 12. We will call it result C. So in summary, S1, which is sum of all 1s, is equal to 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 3 by 2. We call it result C. SE, which is sum of all even integers, which is equal to 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 2 by 12. We call it result B. SI, sum of all integers, is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 1 by 12. This is the Ramanujan's theorem. And SO, sum of all odd integers, <coughs> which is equal to 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus etc. up to infinity, which is equal to 1 by 12, which is ZA. Now we will look into some contradictions arising due to Ramanujan's theorem 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4, etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 1 by 12. The first contradiction goes like this. Let's add the series, the left sides of the series of Ramanujan series and result A. So we get sum 1 is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus etc. up to infinity plus 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus etc. up to infinity. Shifting the result A by one place, we get sum 1 is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus etc. up to infinity plus 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus etc. up to infinity which is equal to 1 plus 3 plus 6 plus 9, the resultant sum, plus etc. up to infinity, which is equal to 1 plus taking out the common 3 from the rest of the series. We get 3 into bracket, 1 plus 2 plus 3, plus etc. up to infinity, which is equal to 1 plus 3 into bracket, the result of 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus etc. up to infinity in Ramanujan series, and the result is minus 1 by 12, which is so the sum becomes 1 minus 3 by 12, which is 9 by 12. So the sum of the two series is for the left sides is 9 by 12. Now adding the result values, the right sides of Ramanujan series and result A series, we get sum 2, which is equal to minus 1 by 12, which is Ramanujan's left hand side, as uh, a right hand side results, and plus 1 by 12, which is the result of Series result series of result A and the sum of the right hand sides will be equal to thus zero. So this gives rise to contradiction 9 12 is equal to zero. Let's look at another contradiction arising because of the results that we got from Navarajan's theorem so far. We derived S1, the sum of all 1s, is equal to minus 3 by 12, which was the result C. Also, we derived SO, which is sum of all odd, in, odd integers, is equal to 
1 by 12, which is result 8. Subtracting the left and right sides of the two series, we get 0 plus 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to 1 by 12 minus of minus 3 by 12, which is equal to 1 by 12 plus 3 by 12, which is equal to 4 by 12. But sum of all even integers, as we derived for series 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus etc. up to infinity is equal to minus 2 by 12. This was the result B. So 4 by 12 is equal to minus 2 by 12. This gives rise to another contradiction. Actually, there are more contradictions which can be proved uh rising because of the Ramarajan series 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 etc up to infinity is equal to minus 1 by 12. If you have any suggestions or you if you see any flaws in these deriv derivations of contradictions, please let me know on my email address given in the beginning. I will really appreciate that. Thank you.